My name is Jared Sibisato and I'm Jason Ponta. Today we'll be presenting an informative video on the function of clutches and bands in an automatic transmission. Bands in an automatic transmission are just that, they're just a steel band with a clutch material on it and they clamp around sections of the gear train. They connect to the housing with clips and are actuated hydraulically with uh, yeah, oil pressure. As they clamp around, they stop the uh, rotation of the drum that uh, houses the clutch packs. Yeah. The advantages of an automatic clutch pack are the unit's torque transferability given its size. They achieve this through multiple friction and pressure plates. They also have a long service life when compared with automatic transmission brake bands. Uh, this makes them popular in today's automatic transmissions. They can even be found in Porsche's Doppelkopplung for 3 bear. The reason why an engineer would use bands instead of clutches is because you can apply more force through levers acting on a uh, fixed end of a band and therefore getting more uh, less slippage and friction. What you've got is a servo push rod actuates on a lever. The lever is attached to the one side of the band. The other side of the band, after it's looped around the drum, comes up from the other side and is attached to the housing. When the servos are actuated, the push rod pushes on this lever, which then clamps around the drum, stopping the drum from turning. What I'm going to do now is show you where to find bands and clutches in a transmission. We've got one here that we've been pulling apart. Most of your uh, drum and everything are all in the middle here, with the input shaft. Take that out. And in here, you find all your, your clutch pack in your drums. And what you do is you take that out. That's one clutch drum there with all your clutch plates in there. If you turn it over you can see where they are. That's what there. What happens is that clamps onto your drum like that. Park in this particular automatic transmission is activated by putting selecting park on your lever, use this rod, push down this hook here, when it's in park, it locks the output shaft in place. <laughs> 